Hey, what's up everybody? We're playing Hades. Now you might be saying, David, Hades 2 came out, man. What are you doing? Well, like usual, I'm a little late. So I just bought Hades like a week ago and I've been having a lot of fun and I do plan on moving to Hades 2, but I had to give the first one a fair shake. So today I thought we'd give ourselves a run. You know, let's just do it together just for fun. Uh, now, I'll just kind of show you where I'm at in the game. Again, I know a lot of you have probably finished the game 20 times over. I haven't. This is currently where I'm at. Uh, I don't. I haven't even unlocked the 30 keys yet, but this is everything else. I've got basically everything max that's important. Um, here's a take a look at my quests. I'm still kind of doing everything. Uh, and I just beat Hades for the first time. First time I beat Hades. That's also kind of what made me want to do this video. Is like I finally beat him. I'm like, okay, maybe I can beat him on camera too. Here's my keepsakes. For now, I'm just using the black shawl. Again, I'm I'm sure there's way better stuff, but you know I don't know about them yet. Uh, I <clears throat> was mainly running the spear for the longest time. That's why I've stuck so many of um, these thingies in here. But we're going to go with the shield. The shield is a lot of fun, especially if we use the aspect of Zeus. I think it is a whole lot of fun. So that's what we're going to use today. <clears throat> you know, uh, actually, no, I don't want to put anything there. Yeah, aspect of Zeus. Here we go. And the cool about uh, the cool thing about this is you can basically uh, use your special and then also block. So you can do damage and block at the same time. I, said, I, I think this is really cool. The shield and the spear are definitely my favorite. I think the spear... <clears throat> is more fun, but I think the shield is easier to new players and guess what I am? I'm a new player So let's go ahead and get started. So since I beat Hades for the first time I am now able to do the pact. So basically now I can make the game harder to earn I think bonus material uh, Which is pretty interesting for this run We're gonna go ahead and just do a normal escape because it's the first one I'm doing on camera with you guys, right? Okay, so, <clears throat> let's start out. Shield, Zeus of Aspect. We're going to get the hammer straight away, which is pretty nice. Okay, so after blocking a foe, gain 20... Ooh, wait a minute. After your special hits, your next two... These are both really good. These are both crazy good. Here's the deal. For 10 seconds? That's basically... Con that's a constant 20% every 10 seconds. But this is... Ooh. Now, I think this Ferocious Guard <clears throat> is actually better. Look, the point of this being so easy is because I can just block everything, right? So I might as well pick up an ability that basically helps me block. I think that'd be the most normal. Okay. What? Oh, okay, good, good, good. Okay, so these there's like these little portals where basically I give up something for a future benefit. <clears throat> Okay, shut up, Chaos. What do we got? For the next... So, each time I special, get hit for negative three, but I gain a cast. Don't want. Your dash... Okay. Wow, these... These all kind of suck. <clears throat> these all kind of suck, not gonna lie. The dash strike isn't gonna be super useful because I'm not gonna be dashing a whole lot. I'm really gonna be using my... My special and my, you know, my charge. So I guess the only one that's even worth it is this gold. Because gold will help me buy more stuff later. Okay, so we're going to go with that. So, and funny enough, that's the best one. And also the debuff is probably the easiest. You know, my dash being lower, I just said, guys, I'm not using my dash. I'm going to be using this move right here. That's the move that I'm going to be using. And I also, I gotta remember to throw out my special. I just recently switched up my controls to where... Oh, and also, you guys are gonna make fun of me, and that's completely okay. I'm actually on keyboard and mouse. I'm not on controller. My friends made fun of me pretty, pretty hard about that, but... Yeah, I've got my special and my attacks both on my mouse now. So, I'm able to pretty easily do them. Yeah, I, I think I've gotten the hang of the, the the shield. I think definitely the thing that I'm best at is probably the spear so far. But the shield, again, it man, it's so beginner friendly. It's pretty hard to not do well with it. You know what I mean? 
Okay, let's see what we got. Your attack is stronger. Cast your death. See, this attack is... That's always just going to be better, right? And that's not really a bad one, actually. Just pure damage. That's really what we're looking for. We're not... We're looking for special upgrades, and we're looking for attack. We're not really looking for a lot of things with dash. We're not looking for things with cast. Um... I've never, I don't really use a lot of calls. I, I know probably in high level play, calls are very useful. I just, I don't, I can't seem to get a grasp on how to use them. Also, I'm going to put it out there. We've kind of gotten unlucky with these first few doors. Usually you like to see a lot of powers and buffs kind of right away. We haven't really seen them, which sucks. Okay, so this guy just gives me things. Okay, so healing, see, and in this case, look, if we're, darkness is probably the best for personal upgrades, but I'm going to take the coin only because I want this run to be a success, so the coin is probably going to be the most useful for me here. Now, I will say this, when I beat Hades, I, I kind of beat him with pretty poop uh, boons, so honestly, if we focus up and make sure to maybe grab some good boons, this really shouldn't be hard. And if anything, I would like to serve, like, this video to serve as, like, almost a tutorial for new players. If you want to be 80s for the first time, kind of look at what I'm doing because I'm in your shoes. And I, like, I feel like I just kindly, I kindly, I just kind of figured it out. And I think the key to this is the shield because, again, it's so beginner friendly, it's stupid. Okay. Okay, see, you're special. This is good. This is great. My special deals more damn And look, that's... Look at that. And the special is really going to be our bread and butter as far as damage along with this dash. But this dash is really just really good because it just blocks everything, you know? Okay, extra health. That's perfect, actually. That's exactly what I want. And oh, I guess that's the other thing. If you guys are wondering, we're targeting special things. We're targeting more attack. And we're, of course, targeting more health. Uh, we're playing the shield character, right? We're, we're playing high defense. Part of high defense is, if you screw up, being able to, for it to not affect you too much. So having a lot of HP will kind of put us in a good zone of, even if we screw up, we'll be fine. And this is going to be especially important for uh, bosses like Hades, where, you know, we're going to be able to block most things, but it's not guaranteed that we block everything, so... Even during my first fight with Hades that I did beat him, I had to use my Death Defiance, you know? Oh, I love these things. Okay, I'm going to teach you guys a little trick with uh, with these survival-type rooms. Look, if you have a shield, what are you doing? Don't. If I see you fighting, I'm going to make fun of you. Look at this. Just stand in the corner, man. Just stand in the corner. Nothing's going to be able to hit you. It's fine, you know? Just stand here. These guys are going to keep swinging. No problem. As long as your shield is facing in the proper direction here. This this also isn't the best corner either. I think I might have a chance of getting hit. Maybe, but I don't even think so. There we go. So he's going to call me incompetent, but also I didn't take any damage, so screw you. Um, let's go ahead and do Divine Strike to level 2. Okay, so, look, this is, a, I want to win this run, so I'm not going to take the jewels. I'm going to go to the store for the chance of, yes, more health. And, you know, I'm also going to take this boon here from Artemis. Your cast, okay, no call. Oh, okay, any damage you deal has a chance to be critical. Yes, that's great. You know what, and... Under normal circumstances, again, I would probably also buy that. Oh, another heart. Oh, okay, this is great. I would buy that, but again, I just, I really just want to win this one. Uh, farming is going to be for another run. So, whoop, got to get out of that bomb range. I hate these bombs. I think by far, the most annoying part about this game is these bombs. And, okay, I can't lie. They make, they make the game a little bit of fun, right? Because, like, oh, we got to be good. But man, are they super frustrating, especially, and I won't, uh, if you get, if this is your first time ever watching Hades, which I highly doubt it, um, 
when we beat the first boss, we'll go to... I, f I forgot what the, basically the hell is called. But that entire place is chocked full of bombs. Okay, so we can either take one boon or two boons. Guess which one I'm going to take. <clears throat> I'm going to go and take the second one with two boons because profit. Now, which one is easier to defend? I think... So, and basically, if you guys don't know here, you get to pick one. <clears throat> and basically, the one that you don't pick, the other god comes and gets angry at you and attacks you. So, essentially, you just want to pick the boon that would be harder to defend against. And I'm new at this game, and I don't really know. But I think Poseidon's pretty easy to defend. So, I'm going to pick... Um, yes, I'm going to pick this. So, again, this is an epic, but it's for cast. I don't need casts. I, I'm not... See, okay, I'm not going to dash a lot, but you're, this, uh, yeah, anything that deflects, that's going to be great for me. So we're going to go with that. Okay, so now we're going to get the other Poseidon boon, but first, we got to basically defend ourselves from him. Um, I'm pretty much guaranteed to lose at least a little bit of HP in these types of, see, like, that guy's going to come, look, look, whatever that thing is, that water thingy. Yeah, so I'm pretty much guaranteed to lose a little bit of HP. Because, I mean, this specific, these specific types of rooms are kind of made, I think, to just be a little harder, obviously, since we're getting two boons. Um, and, I mean, I'll just outright say it. I'm, I can't claim to be the best Hades player in the world thus far, you know. Like, right there, I probably could have blocked that pretty easily, but... Now, this is also <clears throat> kind of new territory for me, because I've never recorded myself playing before. So... Playing and talking, this is kind of new. Okay. So. This is good, right? Because my special knocks away. So now it'll also rupture. This is also pretty useful. But that's more useful for farming materials. I'm going to go and go with Razor Shoals. I think this will be very good. Especially with uh, this. Razor Shoals should be pretty disgusting. Okay. We go to another store. I likely won't have money for anything great. But you know what? I will take this HP. And I don't have enough money to buy the food now. But uh, it's okay. And I think we're facing the boss next. But this is, you know, very easy boss. So I'm not too worried. And hey, we got Meg. All right, great. I know her pattern's the best. So, um, yep. And also, I'm not going to go too deep into the like the story of Hades because, yeah, I don't know. Maybe that, that should be saved for someone who knows a little bit more about the game. But essentially, we are Hades' son. We are stuck in what I presume is Greek hell. We want to get out. There's something about our mother. <laughs> um, we finally got out, and apparently we're tied to this place. So we have, we're basically trying to escape again and again to try to meet our mother. Um, so we can, oh, that sucks for me. I'm like talking and not paying attention. Um, so, and then each time we escape, we kind of get brought back, but we just want to keep talking to our mother. Something along those lines. And then there's a whole bunch of controversy and storylines down here with all the Greek gods. Obviously, like, you know, Poseidon, Hades, uh, Zeus, Hermes, Artemis, Nyx, per Persephone, all the, you know, basically everyone from the Percy Jackson books. Shout out Percy Jackson. Um, yeah, there we go. Easy. Like I said, I'm not even paying attention. I'm literally just talking and with the proper boons on the shield, you're pretty much good to go here. All right, let's pick up our thing and get out of here. We're on to the next part. And this is the part that I said that I basically hate the most. If we were, we really should be getting the coin purse, but all right, is there any good boost okay so basically these are boosts you can buy that temporarily give you positives so i don't need to heal don't really need that yeah i don't also i don't have any money to buy them even <clears throat> even if i wanted to and so far we've gotten pretty good boons so there's nothing that i want to sell all right so we're start of the second layer here and this is again the part that i hate the le most because there's lava everywhere if you step in the lava you're going to get hurt um, and there's traps and there's bombs. Basically everything that I hate, it's probably here. 
So here we go. My, basically, I think the hardest part is going to be for me to talk and not jump in the lava at the same time. That's going to be the hardest part here. But I think we'll make it work. All right, come here. Where are you going? Okay, well, so far it seems like they gave me like one of the easier first levels here. Because there's no bombs, this is one of the wider maps where there's not a whole lot of lava. And <clears throat> even a lot of the maps don't have a lot of lava. Their problem is a lot of the land masses are quite small. Meaning if you're just like dashing around, you're very likely to accidentally jump in lava. You know, and burn your toes a little bit. So let's see, each time you enter chamber, get a wealth. That's not bad. You can dash more times. I'm not really utilizing dashes. So I think my attack speed is actually probably useful here. Yeah, because 10 per ten per chamber isn't bad, actually. But I think the attacking faster is going to help me just a little bit more. And if you hear something in the background, that is my laundry. All right. We're going to go ahead and take the upgrade. Basically, th what that little fruit symbol means is... And also, I just learned half of this stuff like in the past day or two. That gives you an upgrade on one of your existing boons. Obviously, if, if the mark is of one of the Greek gods, that's when you get a new boon. Yes. All right. You know, you can go ahead and eat that. If you guys... Again, I'm just going to talk and assume that you guys have never played Hades before in your lives. If you guys notice, some of them have uh, yellow HP bars, some of them red HP bars. That yellow is basically armor. When they have armor, all of my effects, like I think like knockback and stuns, or knockback works, but like stuns, don't particularly work on them. I have to get them back into the, I have to get them into the red for them to be able to be stunned. So it's pretty important to try to get them out of the yellow fairly quickly. And you do have boons and special powers that basically give you extra damage uh, to armor, which is the yellow. These guys over here, you got to be careful with them. They drop bombs when they die, so you don't want to be near them when they die. All right, let's see an upgrade, your special deals. Okay. I think here we're actually going to do the Tempest Flourish to get a little bit more damage on our special. And if you guys have been seeing, I'm not using my special a whole lot. It's because so far this isn't really hard. Really, the special is just going to be completely disgusting for bosses. It's good here too. But, again, it, it's so e I hate saying it. It's, right now it's kind of so easy. I really don't even need to use my special every second to its like fullest potential because I'm... I'm gonna beat them anyway, as long as I don't do that and, again, step in lava. The, the, these types of maps are the things that suck because it's pretty hard to dash effectively or even use, like, this shield power effectively because I'm scared I'm gonna end up, again, burning my toes. Okay, see, I just stepped in the lava again right there. And each time I step in the lava, it costs me HP. Now, luckily, we've, they, like, we, we've gotten a lot of HP upgrades and naturally we're gonna lose a lot less health than other... Uh, weapons, but right, Artemis, what do you got for me? Cast, useless. <clears throat> My criticals do more, that's good, and cast is useless. Okay, so clean kills the rate, basically the only one we can even go towards. So we've got, I think, okay, here's another deal. I currently have one of the mirror things, which gives me extra damage based on how many boons of each gods that I have. So I don't have this type of boon yet. Meaning if I grab it, I think I'll get an extra 2.5% damage. So this is going to basically incentivize me to grab it. Okay, this is one of the mini bosses for this uh, map or hell, the second layer. These ones actually aren't fun. Uh, this is, I think, personally, and I know a lot of people probably wouldn't agree with me, one of the harder mini bosses because... You have to deal with two things at once, and I don't, I don't know why. I just, I kind of struggle with this one. I can't really give you an exact reason why I struggle so bad with this specific mini boss, but like you can see, I'm already taking some pretty bad damage here, where I probably shouldn't be, but I am. Okay, let's just focus on getting this thing killed, maybe, so we can just deal with the, with the big hopper here. 
Okay, I need you. Can you stay out of the lava so I can kill you, please? You know what? Maybe I'll just live in the lava for a minute just so I can get it killed. Okay, here we go. I just gotta dodge its thingy. Get up close to it. Oh, man, I was hoping I could hit it right then. Okay, dodge out of the way. Okay, now I think I can stun lock it. Okay, never mind. I didn't stun lock it. Okay. There we go. Alright. Okay, Aphrodite. That's Aphrodite. Okay, so cast. Useless. The, ooh. Okay, these are both good. These are both good. I think this one's better. Yeah. Because this will affect things that are alive. This is going to affect things that are basically probably almost already dead. And it's also a rare, meaning it's likely better. But that is definitely better. Alright, fruit. Looks like a pomegranate. That means we're going to get another upgrade. Oh, I love it when this happens. They're not making me fight anything. They're just giving me the upgrade for free. Okay. Um, this is good, but not great. This is good. and These are both pretty good. I think we should increase this. Yeah, to the Divine Strike. That gives us a little bit of HP. Oh, and we're going into a second... I, again, I don't know the classification, but it's like a market homie, you know? Like, you, I come over here, and there's going to be a guy on his, like, lute or guitar. Where is the guy? Wait a minute. I've never seen this person before. This is new. This is completely new to me. I've never seen this before. How's it going, then, your royal majesty? for formalities i'm zagreus just he put you up to this look hun oh i've never seen this person loved but up to two are upgraded whoa 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 whoa, whoa. i don't want to do that because i like the boons that i have this is very good I think the palm porridge here, this is great. Yeah, yeah, this is great. That's what we're gonna do. Wow. Let's go ahead and gift her. Can I can I gift you? Can I not gift you? I like your song, G. Alright, that's great. I mean one level on four of my boons? Man, we're kinda getting lucky. We've gone to a fountain, to like a market person into another market this is crazy bro for real i don't have any money i can't even buy anything that i like okay well wait can we like you, somehow scrounge up That's a lot of oh man i need four more is there any more please dude just give me a little bit more money there's a chance for money and vases please i need one vase to have money please dude come on don't do this to me is there any more vases anywhere? Bro, no way. I just need a little bit more money. Crap. Is there any vases? <laughs> Kidding. <clears throat> okay. Well, I think we just have to deal with the fact that we're not getting it. I feel like a spoiled child. Mommy! I <laughs> I want the health. Give it to me. Oh, I don't think he's going to listen. Okay. Here we go. Boss time. Personally, my, like, favorite boss? I think this one's so cool. I love the music. I love the design. I just, I love the battle. Just, oh, look at it. It's so cool. Okay. Beat him up. I gotta avoid his stomps. That's, like, the main thing, honestly. I've mastered every aspect of this Hydra, I think. Minus the stomps that he does just like that. For some reason, I just, I can't help but jump into the stomps, like, very often. Okay, maybe I should also, I could just attack more too. Okay, so now you can see he has his shield on, meaning he's gonna pull out his cousins. I I just basically gotta rip through the armor and destroy each of his cousins, which will make his head be able to be hit again. There we go. I should probably toss it that way. And there's two cycles of this, so I'm gonna defeat hit these heads. Okay, now I can go back for his main head here. And we're going to do that basically one more time. 
and then I'll be able to kill him. There we go. Okay, avoid his head there. Could also just attack. Okay, he's dropping stones on me. I haven't seen him do that before. Okay, here we go. So one more cycle of going through his heads. You know what? Maybe I'll just leave my special to do work over there. And I gotta utilize my shield properly here. If I utilize my shield, I won't get hit, which is pretty important. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and claim that getting hit is pretty important in this game. But as you can see, I haven't really taken a lot of damage, so clearly what I'm doing is working. I, I say that and I get hit a whole bunch. It's working for the most part. Okay, his head should be vulnerable again. Right? Head's vulnerable. Oh, see, I just jumped right into his stomps like a buffoon. It's got to use my special a little bit. But I'm definitely not in any danger here, so... Ow, ow, ow. Yep, except I'm in the middle of his stomps. But it's okay. We beat him up. Hydra vanquished. Yep. Thank you, Bone Hydra. Cool boss, cool boss. One of my favorites, for sure. Alright, back to a little rest area. Yep. Let's see. Health, don't really need it. Is this good? Eh. This could be useful. But honestly, this next portion is probably the easiest in my opinion uh, man, okay maybe second easiest i think the first the first area is the easiest then this place and then hell and then that's kind of it elysium yeah elysium is not too bad okay so we can go for gold or another hammer upgrade if you guys don't know you only get two hammer upgrades per run in a lot of instances, I would actually choose the other one because I think we're guaranteed two hammers no matter what. So if the other door was a really good thing, I would take that because the hammer is going to be guaranteed later anyway. But in this case, the other one was gold, which I'm not super interested in. I might as well just take the time now to grab the hammer. So that was my reasoning behind it. I don't know if my reasoning is flawed in any way. More experienced Hades players, please tell me if I'm wrong. But I'm pretty sure that's correct. I don't I don't know. Again, I'm still learning, bro. You you, you see that lady? I that's the first time I've ever seen her. And you guys are probably like, what? That's the first time I've ever seen her? Yeah. So, you know. You tell me, bro. Okay, your bull rush gains a power. Oh, that's good. Your attack hits twice, but does not knock okay. Hmm. Honestly, I think Sudden Rush is better here. Basically, I need to be able to get my shield up to block. And Sudden Rush... Wait, that's charges up faster. That doesn't make me pull up my... Hmm. These are all pretty good. That 500 damage is really good. Especially considering how much of my damage comes from that. Honestly, I'm going to go with Minotaur Rush. I think I'm going to go because this thing is... I'm doing a lot of damage with it. So we can go for more... I'm going to go with more health here, I think. Because my boons are pretty good. But I, de I could always use a little bit more HP for sure. Yeah, look at that. That broke through his armor instantly. Yeah. I really hope I selected the right hammer there. I, I, I feel bad because all, all of them were pretty good. All of them were pretty good. So, I can see when you guys are looking at those, you guys have a pretty high chance that you might have picked something different than I picked. Because all of them were so good. Alright, here we go. Just gotta beat these go these guys up. I don't know what these guys are. Are they ninjas? Something like that. Ninjas. Okay, let's use my special again. I gotta I gotta remember to just use my special. 
It's there and it does a good bit of damage. I don't know why I'm not using it. Took a little bit of damage. These circle things seem so innocent, but I actually tend to get hit by their butterfly thingies quite a bit. There we go. I think that's the last one. I'll take that HP. Okay, so we can go to a market or an upgrade. I think I'm going to go ahead and go with the upgrade in this instance because the market's not going to help us too much. Yeah, they're making like hot noises. I think they're ninjas, bro. And again, what's great is these guys are bows, but guess what? I have a shield and it just blocks everything. Of course, I'm sure it's obvious by now, but because I'm using the shield, I am giving up a lot of damage, right? So I'm, I kill stuff a lot slower than other people, but I also don't get hit very often. And if you if you use the aspect of Zeus and just get boons that specifically upgrade your attack, man, it's really not that bad. Like, look, I mean, I'm not taking forever to kill these things. I'm definitely taking longer, but I think I'm not doing too bad, you know? So one of the main complaints about this shield, I think you can fix, to be honest. Like, not doing a lot of damage, like, it's okay. You can fix that in other ways. Oh, I hate these little things because they explode. Okay. Get out of my face. I gotta remember to recall my special too. I seem to forget to do that quite often. Like right now I should recall it. I shouldn't let it go as you know, go super far. God's grant me strength. Okay. Do, 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 I think these this this one might be the best. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with that. I think that's pretty good. So we got more health or another boon. I think I'm gonna continue to go for more health. I, I don't know if this is wise. I could more boons are always great. Yeah, I don't I don't know if that if I'm if I'm doing the correct thing. Cause realistically I could probably live with the amount of HP that I currently have. But I just I really like having a lot of HP, especially for my character and my build. Like it, it just helps out so much later. Like, inevitably as you know a newer player, I'm not gonna know Hades as well as other people. I'm gonna tend to get hit more. So it's important for me to have the luxury of being able to get hit a few times meanwhile some of the rest of you who for sure aren't really gonna get hit it might be useful to have more boons to basically just kill him quicker man these bombs are oh oh i got hit hard by that yeah see that that's a little bit of inexperience showing i think right there okay take that hp Okay, well, we don't need a whole lot of gold, so we're gonna go ahead and go for the boon. Rematch then. All right, another mini boss. We've gotten a little unlucky hitting these mini bosses, but it's okay because this just so happens to be probably the easiest mini boss for the shield. This guy is just pure attack. That's it. Just pure attack, meaning everything we do, we can we can dodge. Like this guy won't hit me. I almost want to, like, make the bold statement that I will kill him before he hits me. See, like, right there? Blocked. Blocked. This guy can't give me anything that I can't block. As long as my shield is towards his direction, this is the easiest boss fight. Blocked. I didn't even mean to block, but I blocked him. Of course, it's going to take a minute. <laughs> Because, oh, okay. Well, I got hit, but that's also because I really wasn't paying attention there. So that's kind of on me. That one doesn't count. <laughs> doesn't count. I make the rules here. It's my video. Sorry. What are you, what are you calling in? Why, what, did you go on Pervious just to talk crap, bro? Seriously? No way. You just paused our match. And I know I could probably kill him much quicker if I just, like, attacked him just like this. But I just, I really just don't want to take damage. So I'm going to slow my DPS. 
Basically for safety here. There we go. I think I only got hit once, and that's just because I kind of lost focus for a minute. I don't think that was too bad. I don't think that was too bad. Who can I gift? Who did I just gift? Oh. Oh, I can gift them? Thank you. Like here? Oh, neat. Okay. So, dash. Not using it. Call. the. Oh, th this is good. Okay, I'm going to say right now. Sure footing is not good for experienced players. Because more than likely, you're not going to hit traps. But guess what? I am. So, I'm going to go ahead and take that. And that's going to help me personally quite a bit. Because I'm pretty prone to stepping in traps. So, that's not a great boon for you guys, but it's going to be a pretty great boon for me. I'm telling you that much. He's offering an exchange. Ooh. Hold on. Oh, these are all so good. These two are really good. I'm gonna have to go for this though, for real. This is great. Oh, this is. I slam a lot of things though. I slam a lot of things. But I think the slam is not gonna be as good for bosses. And this will. I think I'm gonna go with this. I think I'm gonna go with that. Yeah, that one's just good. Okay, Hermes are an upgrade. Let's actually go with Hermes here. Um, yeah. The more boons, the better. Even if I could potentially get something like uh, faster movement speed. Yeah, I'll, we'll take the extra boon here. I think that'll be pretty good. And I'm pretty sure we're going to face the next boss soon. And once again, I'm not going to spoil the boss, but this boss is... Pretty easy with the shield once again. Um, not as easy with some of the other weapons. But I'll tell you guys kind of, I think, why when we get there. Alright, second. Let's go. Second wave, second wave. Okay. There you go. Don't respawn. Don't respawn. I will not allow you. Okay, what do we get? What do we get? <laughs> I literally said we're going to get movement speed. That's hilarious. But greater elevation. Okay, so quick reload is going to be useless because I'm not using casts. Movement speed is important, but I'm also... Most of my movement speed comes from my shield, so it's actually not that useful. Meanwhile, greater evasion. This is pretty good. 10% to not get hit. That's cr that's good. I'm taking greater evasion. And that is... Oh, I have to, guys. I have to. Two more boons? Oh, this is going to make this run so much easier. So, I don't know... I think Poseidon was pretty easy to dodge the first time, right? So, I'm going to go ahead and take this. Okay, so I don't want to replace my Tempest. I don't want to deal anything with my dash because I'm not dashing. And this damage resistance is pretty good, I think. I'm going to go ahead and take the damage resistance. Okay, so now we made Poseidon angry. My homie in the sea. But it's okay because I don't think it's that hard anyway. Even though I love how he's angry at me. and Like, dude, I've got so many of your boons right now. Like... Yeah, I'm taking a good... I took a little bit of damage there. More da Oh, okay. I need to... Okay, I need to get out of that corner. That was... Not my cleanest... Performance in the corner here. Okay. Ah. Yeah, I need to just basically stay away from these bows, I think. Yeah. I'm not super happy with my performance in this room. But... You know what? It happens. We can't have the greatest performance in every room. Hopefully we get something good from it, Poseidon. 
Dash, don't need your boons. That's, oh. Yes. That's exactly what I need. Yes. That's actually really good. That specifically helps me boss for bosses. And then an upgrade or the market. I think in this instance, since we're coming up to the boss, look at my HP. It's my HP isn't crazy high. I might actually be useful to. I was hoping there'd be a healing item. Yeah, because the boss is up next. I was hoping it'd be a healing item. But I'll take the extra HP. And you know what? I'll even take this boon. A critical. Dash strike is not going to help me too much in cast. So Hunter's Mark is the only thing that's good here. Okay. Well, we're going in with a little bit of HP missing. But like I said, technically this boss is should be on the easier side for me. And as you can see, there's two of them. There's two bosses, which makes this fight really easy to get hit, right? But what do I have in my possession? I have a shield that blocks all damage. So that's the thing. A lot of people tell me this fight is very hard because, like, they just can't stop getting hit. Well, oh, I got hit. Oh, well, what am I doing? I got, I got hit there a few times somehow. Luckily, I just keep my shield in the direction of kind of both of them, and no issues. No issues at all. Again, I should be doing a little better with my special here. Okay, see, it, it maybe in those instances I can get a little lucky. And now he's going to draw upon the gods, because he's a giant wuss. Yeah, Bozo, you're still losing. Sorry to tell you. I throw my special in there. Oh, look at that special damage. Juice, juice, juice. If I was smart, I'd even maybe throw in my cast. Okay, I gotta stay out of that whirlpool thing. Okay. Alright, I'm taking a little bit of damage. Oh, wowee, wowee. Okay, David, come on, man. What are you doing? I am kind of pooping the bed here a little bit. A lot of this damage I really should not be taking. I, I would hate to use one of my death defiances here. Okay. Luckily, we killed him. Okay, come on. We just gotta kill him before dying. Let's go. Okay. So we don't have to use our death defiance. That's, that's important that I don't have to use my death defiance there. But... He put me through it. That was dangerous. He put me through it. Golden touch. Yep. Okay. Okay. I'm going to need this. Because I need more HP. And this might be useful. But I don't think I'm going to buy it. For the sake of there might be something good out there, but that healing is going to be pretty important. I'm going to need a little bit more HP because I'm I'm kind of going in. And spoiler, this is the last territory here. I'm going in a little weak on HP. Let's grab, let's make sure to break some of these vases because they could contain a little gold. Let's make sure to break them. Okay, here we go. This is kind of the last portion of the run. Let's take a look at our shop. So we got a 150 and then an upgrade. Let's go ahead and take just buy the 150 here. Yeah. Artemis. Okay, I think we're going to grab that. That gives me more crit for armor, while the other two weren't as useful. So basically what we do here is it gives us five basically tunnels and we have to find the tunnel that has Cerberus's dog food. We don't know which one it is, but we have to find it. So I'm going to assume, let's just, um, let's go for the upgrade first. Hello. Ooh, rats. Actually, rats are pretty easy. I can just throw up my special... 
and I'll basically be good. And I do gain a little bit of HP when I go through all these doors, which is nice. These rats, I have to be careful because they drop poison upon death, and they also like to puke, puke for some reason. So I have, when I kill it, I have to stay away from it. Because I don't want to get puked on. Oh, of course he has a lot of armor. See, I got, I got bit. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get salmonella, bro. Wait, no, that's in raw meat. Uh, rabies? Do rats carry rabies? I don't know if that's just like squirrels and possums or something, but... Do gain a little bit of HP. Just nice. These things are pretty easy to kill because their main damage source is lasers. And luckily, my shield blocks lasers. No problem at all. Make sure to kill this before it starts firing. Oops, see, I'm taking a bit of damage. Um... I'm gonna let... See, I'm gonna have to find, like, a pattern. There we go. Pattern where they kind of aren't shooting. Okay, I've taken a little bit of HP from these. I've lost a good bit of HP from these guys. Which kind of sucks. Nope, don't do that. Ooh, 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 ooh. Come here. Ooh, okay. See, why are you over there? I can't hit you over there, man. There you go. Knock him. Knock him towards the edge. There you go. Yeah, okay, come on. These, these guys spit poison, don't they? I need to be careful not to get hit by their poison. Oh, and there's rats. Oh, man. I gotta, I gotta make sure not to, not to step in that poison. That's the problem here. Let's just kill this thing. Come here, you stupid rat. There we go. Okay, damage resistance is always good. Okay. These two are both good. I think I'm going to take the wave pending, though. Okay, so sadly that was not... I was not the one with... It's food. Okay, let's go for the heart. I want more HP. So let's hope it's this one. Why am I getting hit? Okay. Ooh, big one. Go. These guys are a little scary, because I think they can spit poison, which is always kind of... Makes me nervous. That can lose a lot of HP very quickly. By being poisoned. Okay. It, there it is. Okay. Dog food. And I get health from the fountain. Okay. This is it, everyone. We Okay, now we could continue to get things, but I've got everything I need. I don't want that gold, and I really, I don't want to give up HP for more boons. Because remember, I don't get another one of those fountains. If I lose HP, I lose it permanently, essentially. One more upgrade. I think our attack being stronger is probably the most useful here. Okay, I think we've done everything we could do. For us to be successful.
So, we're gonna continue. I can go. Okay. This is it, everybody. This is it. Again, I've only beat Hades once. So this is only my second time. I am just as nervous as you guys are. But again, if we use our shield properly, we make sure you use our specials. This should be fine. We should be able to do this. There we go. And excuse me if I maybe stop talking. I'm trying to I'm gonna have to maybe focus. You now know that even if you are able to surpass me, you shall ultimately perish. I found her father, and I'm going to find my silence boy. Say okay, here we go. I'm gonna try to th throw my special right away here. Again, all a lot of his attacks I'm able to dodge. So he's going to attack from somewhere. Alright, we're doing good so far. His big swing is what does the most amount of damage, I think. And luckily, we can just completely avoid that big swing for the most part. There we go. Oh, I got hit there because I wasn't ready. I got hit because I wasn't ready. I wasn't I wasn't blocked up. Can't make that mistake again. Okay, he's impervious. Let's maybe get away here. I'm gonna call on a few of his goons. Which is fine. Call in your goons. And not doing a whole lot of damage here. But it's okay. Because we're not getting hit. That's the important part. No, we're not being timed. Well, we're, we are being timed, but... As far as beating him, I don't, like, run out of time. So I'm okay with being patient and just not getting hit. Let's make sure to not get hit by him. Darkness. Not to get hit by his darkness. I got hit. Got hit pretty hard there. Why do you keep doing this time after time? Because I want to. Don't tell me what to do, Dad. Ooh, I, I had a chance of actually getting hit from behind right there. That corner is not good. I need to get out of that corner. Yep, you see, a mistake was made right there. I shouldn't have... I don't know why he keeps going in that corner. That corner is so frustrating. Alright, he should be dead in a second here. Please. There we go. There we go. Second phase, second phase. It's not it's not done yet. You guys thought we were done? We're not done. This is just second phase. Let's see you deal with this. What if I don't want to, huh? Oh, those pots suck. I gotta try to avoid those pods. They grab me and they do damage. All of those big lasers, guess what? I can block with my shield. Yeah, eat that. Somehow this run has been... This phase is turning out better than the first phase somehow. I don't know if he's just standing in one place, which is making it quite a bit easier. Oh, I'm going to get hit by a hand. Okay, I got pretty lucky to not get hit by a hand right there. I'm going to take this opportunity to do a little damage. Blocked it. Okay, impervious for a second, meaning he's going to call some things in. Ooh, I'm going to make a bold claim and say it, it might be a little hard to die from here. But never say never. I could screw up pretty badly from here on out. If I if I keep letting myself get hit by those, I could get in trouble. See, I let that go through. And I really shouldn't have. I 
take this opportunity to hit him a few times. Throw out my Q. I'm going to take this opportunity to hit. I took a little damage there to get a little... Oh! I got hit by a hand. Exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, I'm just going to go. Didn't even have to use my Death Defiance. I'm telling you guys, the shield is easy. It's easy. If you get the Aspect of Zeus, and you just get some decent boons that rely on attack, and you're special, it's it's easy, dude. It's easy. Yeah. Again. Die already. Later. Yes. All right. There is our run. Took about 33 minutes. We didn't use any heat, though. We didn't use any heat. But I think we honestly could have cranked up the heat, and I would have been completely fine. The only time, which is a little, like, iffy, was maybe the third boss, which I thought was going to be the easiest. That actually almost took away our death defiance. But even Hades, I didn't even have to use my Death Defiance. Um, but I think we did pretty good with our boons. I'm going to be 100% with you. I think we did pretty good with our boons. And I hope maybe this serves as a good tutorial for new players, but also maybe a good tutorial on how to use the shield too, you know? I Look, I'm, I'm going to toot my own horn a little bit. I thought I did pretty good with the shield. I, the building it, I think I did pretty good. So... I also, I think I got pretty good hammers too, though, so, you know, you never know. Alright, we might as well play this out. So, again, as far as the story, I found out my real mother is not Nyx, it's Persephone, which is up in Greece. I visited her one time and I got sent back. This is the second time I'm visiting her. Just for the sake of story-wise, if you guys are wondering. I think, I think, I'm back! Turn to me. Perhaps I. Father didn't make it any easier for me. Nor would he tell me why he never said. I wanted to see you too. Come. I just. I need to know what happened between you and father. Why are you here and not with us? I couldn't live with myself anymore down there. After I left Olympus, along. I know the feeling. I think. But you stayed. Long enough to have me. No, no. Your father could be very difficult. Though he was gentle with me. Soon enough, we got on fine. Better than... Could not live down there according to whom, exactly? The fates? According to them, yes. According to your father and to Nyx. Even having heard... Uh, but why would father lie to you? If he never wanted you... Or never wanted me... I don't know. I'm wondering the same. But, oh, look at you, Zagria. I'm trying, but I can't stay that much longer, I don't think. Oh, my dear son. Then please, ask Hades what you asked of me. Why he would lie. Alright, so yeah, we can only stay up. For a little while, and then we sadly have to go back. Back into the puddle we go. And we're back. And that's kind of the game. Okay. Well, I think I'm going to leave it off there, guys. I really hope that you guys like this video. Man, I like this game quite a bit. I, again, I only started playing it recently, but I like it quite a bit. And I think I'm going to start playing Hades 2 very soon. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys.